Are you thinking about making some serious money in 2024? Well, here's a heads up. It's time to ease up on using AI for everything. Now, don't get me wrong. AI is cool and all, but it can make us a bit lazy and not so sharp. The real deal is to mix in some good old-fashioned hard work with a bit of AI help. Think of AI like a helpful sidekick, not the boss. In order to build some real wealth, you need to start using AI as a tool, not the top dog. So before you outsource every single task to chat GPT, make sure you watch this video until the end. I'm Will, and I teach people about investing, personal finance, and money. I've walked the path you seek, and today I have several businesses and investments that provide me income every single month, meaning I never have to work another day in my life. If you plan on becoming financially free, be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the like button if you find this video valuable. So here are five reasons you need to stop using AI if you want to build real wealth. Number one, loss of critical thinking. Think about it this way. You're using AI for advice on everything big and small. Now this seems super convenient at first, right? But here's the catch. When you get used to having answers served up on a silver platter, after a while your brain will start getting a bit lazy. It's like those muscles you're not exercising. They start to weaken over time. So when it comes to really important stuff, like figuring out where to invest your hard-earned cash or how to manage your budget, you might find yourself feeling stuck. Let's say you always rely on your GPS to get around. One day it conks out and you have to find your way without it you might realize you don't really know the streets as well as you thought. That's kind of like using AI for financial decisions. If you don't regularly work through those numbers and strategies yourself, your ability to navigate the complex world of finance might not be as sharp as you need it to be. And when you're constantly asking AI for advice, you might start missing out on learning from your own mistakes and successes. Figuring things out the hard way, like why an investment didn't work out, or what made another one a winner is a huge part of growing your financial smarts. This hands-on experience is super valuable. It's not just about knowing the right answers, but understanding why they're right. And most of the time, AI can't give you that depth of understanding. Number two, reduced problem-solving skills. Imagine you've got this cool AI app that sorts out all your financial issues. Need a budget? It's got you covered. Investment advice? Just a click away. While it sounds super convenient, there's a flip side. Think about when you're playing a video game with cheat codes. Sure, you breeze through the levels, but you really learn how to play the game well. Not so much. Now apply that to managing your finances. The financial world is like a big, unpredictable game. The markets go up and down, new opportunities pop up, and sometimes things go sideways. If you're always letting AI do the thinking and problem solving for you, you might not develop the skills you need to navigate these twists and turns. Here's a practical example. Let's say the stock market takes a sudden dive. If you've been relying on AI for all your investment moves, figuring out what to do in this new situation can be tough. Should you sell, buy more, or just wait it out? AI might give you some suggestions, but without your own problem solving skills in the mix, those suggestions might not be enough. Problem solving in finance is also about being creative and thinking outside the box. Maybe there's a unique investment opportunity or a new way to save money that AI wouldn't typically suggest. If you're actively involved in managing your finances, you're more likely to spot these opportunities and take advantage of them. Number three, lack of creative financial strategies. Now, AI is like this big recipe book that's got all the standard dishes. It's great when you need something tried and true, but what if you want to whip up something new and exciting? That's where your own creativity in the kitchen, or in this case, your finances, really matters. When you rely on AI for all your financial decisions, you're mostly getting cookie-cutter advice. It's based on algorithms and data from a bunch of people, but it might not fit your unique situation. Let's say you're thinking about investing. AI might point you to the usual stocks and bonds. But what about that quirky startup or an unconventional real estate deal? 
These could be golden opportunities, but AI might not flag them because they're out of the ordinary. Here's a real-world example. Imagine you've got a chance to invest in a local business. It's a bit risky, sure, but you know the area, you understand the market, and you've got a good feeling about it. An AI tool might steer you clear of this because it doesn't fit the usual investment profile. But with your personal insight and creative thinking, you could spot a winner that AI would miss. Or think about budgeting. AI can give you a standard budget plan, but what if you have an irregular income, like if you're a freelancer or run your own business? You need to get creative with how you manage your money, setting aside funds when times are good to cover you when they're not. AI might struggle with these nuances, but your own creativity and understanding of your financial rhythm can make all the difference. If you're enjoying this video, smash that like button as it really helps the channel. Thanks. Number 4. Echo Chamber Effect If you're only hanging out with people who think just like you, they're all nodding and agreeing with you all the time. But here's the thing. You might be missing out on some really interesting different viewpoints. This is what can happen with your money matters when you're getting all your advice from AI. So, AIs like this well-meaning friend who keeps feeding you info based on what it thinks you like or what's worked for you in the past. This is cool for things like choosing music or movies, but in finance it's a whole different ballgame. You need a variety of opinions and strategies, especially since the financial world is so wide and varied. For instance, let's say you've got an AI tool that helps you with stock investments. It looks at your past choices, maybe you've had a good run with tech stocks, so it keeps suggesting more of the same. But what about other sectors, like renewable energy or healthcare? You might be missing out on some great opportunities because the AI is not showing them to you. It's like having blinders on that keep you looking in one direction only. Also, consider global events like economic shifts, new government policies, or international trends. These can really shake things up in the financial world. An AI stuck in its echo chamber might not be quick or flexible enough to factor in these big picture changes and adjust its advice accordingly. Number 5. Diminished Learning and Adaptability Now most of you probably have a trusty AI app that's like your financial oracle. Need to know where to invest? Ask the AI. Wondering how to save money? The AI has a plan. It's super convenient, sure, but here's the hitch. If AI is always spoon-feeding you answers, you might not really learn the nuts and bolts of personal finance. Let's say the stock market takes a sudden turn or there's an economic downturn. If you've always leaned on AI, adapting to these changes can be tough because you haven't developed the instincts or the understanding to navigate them on your own. You're used to a set pattern, and when that pattern breaks, it might feel like being in uncharted waters without a compass. And think about all the learning opportunities you miss. Every financial decision has a story. Why something worked, why it didn't, what could be done better next time. If AI is handling it all, you're skipping these valuable lessons. It's like reading the summary of a book instead of the whole thing. You get the gist, but you miss out on the details and the depth. So yes, we all know AI can help us out, but be sure you do not rely on it for everything. If you're interested in learning how you can build wealth with dividend investing, check out this video next.